Thanks for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. If you are new here, my name is Rachel and I love makeup. So today I wanted to play with makeup. I wanted to play with color. So I wanted to do something very tropical, very smoky. And this is what I came out with. So if you would like to see how I achieved this colorful peacock smoky eye, <laughs> then just keep watching. Okay, so hopefully you guys like my new background. I am moved into my new place. I'm so, so happy here. I decorated it and everything. If you guys would like to see my room tour, I will link it right up here for you. All right, so since it is almost the end of summer, I wanna do like one more bold, colorful look. So to start off today, I'm using the BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette since this has a wide range of colors in it. I'm gonna be using this bright orange and this pink right here and this red. So we're just gonna kind of blow out the crease with those three colors. Okay, so now I have primed my eyelids. I did not set my eyelids because I want this to be very, very colorful and vibrant. So I'm just gonna go in with the orange now and put that in the crease. And this is gonna be pretty smoky, so I'm bringing it all the way to the inner corner. Now I'm gonna take a smaller blending brush. This is the Morphe M514. And I'm gonna use um, the pink. So I'm gonna use this outer pink right here. This is just gonna be a lot of layering colors to build intensity. With that same brush, I'm gonna use um, the red shade. And I know that this red is pigmented, so I'm gonna tap off the excess and I'm gonna put this in the darkest part of the crease. So now that we have that bright, vibrant crease going on, we got the pinks, the oranges, and a little bit of red, I'm gonna use the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe collaboration, uh, the Vault Collection. And as promised, I'm going to be using this color today. It's called Gem, and it is beyond pigmented. So I'm gonna put that on my mobile eyelid. So for this, I'm gonna use a packing brush, the Morphe M167, and I did not spray anything on this brush because I wanna show you guys how pigmented this shade is. So I'm gonna dip into Gem. That is without Fix Plus. Wow. I actually am gonna put a little bit of Fix Plus on there if I can find it. So without Fix Plus, as you can see, this is super pigmented, but I'm, I want it to be like crazy. So I'm going to use setting spray and spray my brush. Now let's go into the color gem one more time. Oh yeah. That is what I'm talking about. So to blur out um, the harsh line there, I'm gonna use this Eco Tools brush, and this is the Liner Smudge brush. Dip into that orange a little bit again, and let's just blur out that harsh edge. Just be aware that as soon as you put that purple down, you're gonna be blending the two together for quite some time, <laughs> um, but it's gonna be worth it. So I just um, basically just re-intensified the crease color and then now we can put on some lashes. Okay, so we have the eyelashes on. These are Lily Lashes in the style Miami. Today I'm gonna use L'Oreal Pro Glow in the shade 207 since I am tan at the moment. Now let's conceal those under eyes and also brighten them up. I'm gonna do the nose because my nose is so sunburned. Chin and forehead. And then to bake the face, I'm gonna use the Fit Me 
loose finishing powder in 05 fair this is pretty fair but I again I want it to brighten right now so I'm gonna press that underneath the eyes I'm not really baking I'm just kind of setting it I thought I was gonna bake but ain't nobody got time for that and for the rest of the face I'm gonna take a big fluffy brush and then just kind of go over it to set it in place for brows today, I don't really feel like doing something super precise, so I'm gonna just take this defining brush, and in the Jaclyn Hill palette, I'm gonna use this dark brown. It always looks super intense on camera, but I promise in person, it doesn't look nearly as intense. <laughs> you may think that for the under eye eyeshadow, um, I'm just gonna use the same colors. I'm gonna do something very different today. So I want to do like a bright blue, like turquoise almost, and then underneath I wanna do yellow. I'm gonna first go in with this teal right here. Honestly, it's not quite blue enough, so I'm gonna go in with Pool Party. Now to blend out that blue, I'm going to go in with this super vibrant yellow right here with a fluffy brush. I'm going to use this pencil brush and then some Fix Plus or setting spray. And I'm going to dip into Pool Party. I'm going to put this on the lower lash line, like really tight with the lower lashes. That's what I was looking for. All right, so that is the eyeshadow complete. Let me just throw on some mascara on my lower lashes. So now let's sculpt the face. I feel like a peacock with these eyes. Like, are these like peacock colors? Now for blush, I'm gonna use the Flower Beauty blush in Sweet Pea. I just used this blush in the um, the Jaclyn Hill Bling Boss review that I did. Uh, if you have not seen that, I will link it right up here. But this blush is gorgeous, I love it. It's so pretty. And finally, to highlight today, I'm gonna use Champagne Pop and I'm gonna go ham on this today. Gonna do it above the eyebrows, down the nose, Cupid's bow, and chin. I'm also gonna put a tiny bit on my brow bone, and then on the inner corner as well. To finish off the look, we're going to use this Luna Lip Crayon in the color Elera. If you wanted to keep uh, the lips being baby pink, then you could stop here. But I'm going to put a tiny bit of MAC Honey Love over it. Just so that it's not quite as pink. And the last step. Okay everyone, so that is everything. That is this completed look. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I upload videos all the time. Also, if you feel so inclined, please leave a comment down below of what kind of makeup look you would like to see next, and I will definitely do that for you. So that wraps up this video. I hope that you all enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys on my next video. If you guys wanna see my room tour, tour. Since it's almost the uh, I'm gonna zoom you in a little. Hey, <laughs> Ew, that was so creepy. So now that we have that um that bribe bribant bribe that bad bad. So this uh, uh, what am I saying? So I just went back in and put more of those of those. So I'm gonna use this pencil brush and then some, wow, to, look at my hair. <laughs> I'm 
So that wraps up this video. Don't forget to subscribe. That's thumbs up, not subscribe.